Police need your help this morning in finding the guys who were behind a break and it happened at a gas station and a church on Detroit's northeast side. 7 Action News reporter Nima Shafe is joining us live this morning as well. New surveillance video he has of men who want to talk to police. Or police want to talk to them. Nima? Alicia and Vic, good morning. This is a small church here, as you mentioned, on Detroit's northeast side that has many of its parishioners waking up this morning, wondering, one, how they'll have service this Sunday, and two, how they'll feed dozens of people that will be hungry on Thanksgiving. Take a look at this new surveillance video into the 7 Action newsroom, and while it's hard to get a good description of the suspects, our purpose in showing you this video is to show you just how brazen these men were. The surveillance video taken from a nearby gas station showing the bandits rummaging through tires and scrap metal before moving to the church. It's believed the men then broke through a window at the landmark Church of God in Christ, and among the things taken, pipes from a water heater that now is rendered useless. This morning we're hearing from a parishioner. What nerve, you know, to even come into God's house. Because, like I mentioned, we are a giving church. We give to the community. Whatever God has blessed us, we give it back. And at the trouble of having to repair a window and now having to render a water heater useless and fix that, the break in comes at a time when parishioners here, about 50 of them in this small church, are mourning the loss of their pastor. We're live on Detroit's Northeast Side this morning. I'm Nima Shafe, 7 Action News. Back to you.